Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see types of sections that are used in tension member. So let's start with the video. See, these are the various sections that are used as a tension member. We have seen these various sections in the first lecture also. But some of the sections may be new to you, like this one. See, this is nothing but a type of built up box or sections. So, what happens in this type of sections, as I told you in the previous video also, let us consider that you are having a channel section like this. Okay, and they, you have another channel section like this. So, how these are placed? They are placed face to face. You can have different arrangement also like this. There is one channel like this, and there is another channel like this. So this arrangement is known as channels placed back to back. Means their back is getting connected with each other. No, and this one is face to face connection or face to face placing. So this one is your two channels placed face to face and this one is two channels placed back to back so why we are using this type of sections two channels for example let us consider that you are having only one channel section and its load carrying capacity is 100 kilo newton i'm just giving an example you don't take it as the value i'm just giving an example that this channel section is having a load carrying capacity of 100 kilo newton but what you want, you have only option of using channel sections and you want a capacity at least 200 kN. So what you will do, you will place these channel sections in such a way that it will be get converted into some different shape and that new shape will be called as built up section. So in this, see, if you are connecting these two channels, they are getting connected and new shape is getting created that is box shape. But the sections are known as built up sections. So, what you will do for its proper integrity, for its proper strength, for its proper binding or bonding, you will use these two plates and you will attach them either by like this, means by bolting, or you can weld them. You have two options either welding or the bolting. What you have, you have two options. You can use welding, you can weld them together, or you have bolting, means you can use the bolt. Or the rivets so in this way you can connect them and by connecting them obviously it will have the strength more than this because you are using two channels and even the plates are also used they are getting connected by proper means either by bolting either by welding and finally you will get the new sections and those sections can also be used as a tension members so what i am showing i am showing you the different sections that are used as tension members so in exam you will have to draw this not only write down you can first list out them then you can draw these various sections so that not a single mark will be deducted so what are the various types of sections that are used in tension member we have round bar like this if you see the 3d view it will look like this round bars okay then we have flat bar like this if you want to see the 3d view again it will be like this like this so this is your flat bar then we have angle even the 3d view of angle you can see for example this is your angle and it will be like this this one will be its length okay then we have double angle we have starred angle see two angles are connected like this they will be placed like this means one will be placed like this and another will be like this so this uh, particular arrangement is known as starred angle then we have simple channel section, double channel section. They can be connected like this by welding or bolting. Then we have two channels which are connected by a plate. So that is also one arrangement. Then we have W section. It is not just the W section actually. Huh? It is known as ISWB. We have seen this concept. What is the full form? You can pause the video and you can think on that what was the full form or what was this type of section that we have used i have told you this already that this type of there are various types of sections i sections 
various types of channel sections various types of angle sections and so on in previous videos so what isw stands for so it stands for indian standard wide flange beam we have given here wide flange so it is iswb indian standard wide flange beam then we have issc i s s b or is ah yes issb so what it stands for indian standard standard beam indian standard standard beam this is the standard beam american standard indian standard there are various standards available so india standard standard beam standard section beam then this sections i have explained here so these are the sections then we have another sections like this even you can use the cables as tension members this i have told you that you can use various cables even you can bind them together you can compose them together and you can form the tension members so that its capacity will also be increased load carrying capacity then this one i have shown you see if even the t sections can also be used as a tension members so these are all various types of sections that are used as tension members so this was the video on types of sections that are used in tension members thank you